Hello everyone and welcome to a new episode of Robert Plays Minecraft. Welcome back, welcome back. As uh, you may notice, <laughs> I've uh, I've gone overboard with the villages, <laughs> but uh, I've I've not uh, went through their trades yet. I just um, put them in place because I have I wanted to have that done. So these are behind me here. We have. Uh, the tools and uh, equipment. These are the stonesmiths for colorful blocks. We got the mending guys over there. Mending guys, the librarians, and I have two uh, cartographers. And also three farmers over here, and then uh, I believe it's one of each. Well, one of each except the. Brewer or whatever, you, what, what, what was it called? I made a space for them over here, but I don't have uh, the brewing stand for them. So that's gonna that's gonna have to wait for later until we get to find the fortress in the Nether. Oh, that reminds me, we we might do that in this episode. Let's see how we get with the villagers. I wanna get geared up and. Uh, get some food and all that and then we can uh, explore the nether I'll come back when I have a, a few materials set up this is unbelievable I've never been this lucky in my entire life let me let me show you uh, we've uh, brought everybody to diamond level I will um, I will spare you the, the details because this took me many 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 hours and uh, I've um, kept trying and trying and trying but I got some amazing uh, books I didn't get all of them I don't I don't have fortune but we we got feather falling multi shot whatever this this guy is not that good I need to redo him efficiency 5 I cannot believe this I got efficiency 5 on this one and then soul touch flame riptide 3 and infinity um, wait wait Mending on this one. Depth Strider. Fire Aspect 2. Better Falling 4. And Breaking 1. Infinity Lure 3. And it's amazing. And I got a few down here. Um, Infinity. And breaking two, loyalty three, channeling and sharpness. Creepy zombie. <clears throat> okay. Thorns. We got two thorns three on this. It's crazy. And looting three. I was actually. Hoping for another turn. <laughs> Impelling five. That's crazy. Punch two. Depth Strider one. I'm breaking three. Bane of the Arthropods. Respiration three. Luck of the Sea one. Sharpness two. Channeling, flame, and mending. Too many, actually. Crazy, crazy, crazy. But yeah, that's uh, that's pretty much it. Let me put a torch down here because I believe it's not that lit. Yes, yes, yes. 
Now we should get less damage when we fall. Inspiration of Affinity. Nice. We're all set. I don't know if we can... Uh, probably we can make it them better, the enchantments, but... It's fine, we don't need to. Infinity. Nope. Efficiency. Riptide. Punch. That could be good. I'm breaking this. This I need this. Um, infinity. There we go. For the falling. I had them. I knew it. But I couldn't find them. <laughs> I'll leave that open as well. Uh, bu 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 no. Infinity and breaking. There we go. And we got an arrow over here. <clears throat> Should be fine. Okay, we could put flame on it also, also but. I'm not gonna. We're going. We're going to the nether. We're going to the nether. I made a tunnel, might as well use it. Boom, boom, boom. Now. I really hope we won't have any surprises on the other side. Because it's been a while since I've been there. And monsters can spawn. Like, go past. Okay. So far, so good. I'm gonna. <clears throat> foolproof it on this side okay this will work <laughs> at least uh, we won't have any creepers waiting for us on this side This place is massive. And I don't know where to go. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> that was nice. We made a tunnel. Please tell me. Please tell me that's what I think it is. Uh, 
What the? Huh. Take that. I don't know why... Why he wanted to fight, but... There you go. Oh yes, there's a fortress and a blaze. And, and skellies as well. Ah, oh, this is great, this is great. Okay, it's time to go. Hopefully, we're not gonna die. Let's go, let's go. Nice and easy. Yes. 20 blaze rods. I'm uh, I'm happy with that. And we make a brewing stand. Let's make a few actually. We're gonna make four. Yes, one, two, three. And then we're gonna put one over here. No space in my inventory, of course. Okay, we fill them with water. Boom, boom, boom. And it's ready. We're gonna brew stuff in there, but for now, three carpets. My cat wants something, but I don't know what. What's up, dude? What's up with you? Right, and over there we're gonna put uh, three villages. But uh, oh, I need to take down the the behind over there. We're gonna put them through the back and drop them in. But not right now. It's uh, it's a pain. That was an adventure. Oh my god, I cannot believe this. But we have uh, the brewing stands now. We can brew potions. We could make some fire resistance and all, a lot of other potions. But uh, we're gonna talk about potions in a different episode. Probably we're gonna make like a, a specific episode for each feature of the, the game. Okay, I uh, took the leaves down from uh, from a few trees over here. We're gonna we're gonna take all the trees down all the way to that hole over there there's like a, a massive crater going in the center of the world I don't know but I wanna do 
a farm for the sheep over here. And uh, digging this out, I got an idea. We're gonna we're gonna build them in the hill, and because uh, there are a few colors, we're gonna make every color in the game and um, dye the sheep with it and all the sheep will produce <clears throat> the wool for the specific color we're gonna make it down here hmm? yeah we're starting over here <laughs> it's gonna be a wider area. Right, so we have in this chest I've, I've gathered some materials and I went and got some stone as well. We're gonna use it as building blocks. So we need 16 uh, dispensers. I'm saying 16 because there are 16, 16 different colors of wool of wool and I want to make one for each so you need one observer one uh, dispenser you know what uh, we'll get everything and um, we're gonna walk our way through it now Okay, so the observer will go over there. Technically, the observer sees the the block in in front here, and every time the block it's uh, happening something with it, it will give a signal over there. When it when it gets uh, updated. For example, even if I turn that into a pot like this, it's gonna get a signal. See? So, everything that happens to it, it receives a signal. Right, on that, uh, on that notice, when, when that happens, it will power the block beneath this redstone, and the block will power the redstone, that's what happens here. And then we're gonna put a, a dispenser over here, facing this way. And um, every time, every time that uh, happens, the dispenser will um, use what is inside of them. And uh, in this case, we're gonna put a shear inside. We're gonna put more of them, but one for now. So every time that happens, it will try to use it. Now, it didn't consume any durability because there's nothing there. But um, if it succeeds in using it, then it's gonna consume durability. And by this, this principle, the block here It's uh, gonna be grass. We're gonna make that. And inside there, we will have a sheep. I think it's better if we put it there. Oh, no. Put a glass on top of that. And... Uh, and the hopper going up. Oh, 
Yeah, this line on top here will be hoppers going that way. And then it goes down there. Perfect. So far, so good. Um, I don't believe we need... anything down here. So we could uh, cover it. Just like that. Okay, that's one. We're gonna mimic it on this side. But we're gonna make it on the other orientation. Right, so we got observer. What's wrong with my scroll? Redstone Dispenser Hoppers going in here Good We cover that We cover this And this. There we go. Second chamber finished. Cover it up. But we need to supply it. There we go. I believe one of these has blocks in it, yeah. There we go. Okay. We are pretty much done with the, the top part. We need to go underneath now and uh, solve the collection bit. Idiot. Why did he explode? I thought I was far away. Okay, we're gonna dig ourselves a nice area underneath. Okay, okay, we need to make the collection system for this. So, we are gonna place a chest over here, just like that. And then put a hopper in, in it. Another chest on top of that. And a hopper on top of that. And uh, the hopper will be on top of the block. Now, we put a rail over there, and on the rail we put a, a hopper minecart. And we break the rail after. I believe uh, 
it will uh, still collect things, even if it's broken. Or not. Maybe we need the rail. Okay, let's leave the rail. There we go, they disappear. Yeah, and everything that drops over there gets collected in this. Yeah, so this is the collection bit for for the, every module. We need to do this on every single one out here. So I will uh, I will be a minute. Perfect. Now every time... They're gonna get collected over there. Boom, boom, boom. a lot of shears and send them through the system they should end up in in here oh, stupid skelly we need to put some uh, around here. There we go. She ate the the wall. She ate the grass and uh, she got sheared. Whenever sheep eat grass the wool will uh, regrow and this will detect that and will get sheared. So that's pretty much it. We need to just get more sheep and dye them different colors. One for every color. There's 16 all together. We're gonna start with white over here, but yeah. The grass will uh, get re-populated, whatever. It will transform back to grass from dirt. Whenever they eat the grass, it transforms to dirt. And that's the difference that uh, the observer detects and down below. When uh, when the grass transforms to dirt, the observer sees that and activates the dispenser. And we have a shear inside, so that's used on the ship in front of it. And that way we got uh, unlimited wool. Well if the sheep don't die, but they shouldn't. Everything should be safe. And yeah, that's uh, that's pretty much the sheep farm. This is one of the nicer farms. <laughs> I do like them, because it's uh, they make a lot of different colors and uh, in amazing quantities. And I wanna, I wanna finish that iron farm behind me over there. Well, yeah, that will be it for this one. <laughs> we've uh, we've done a little bit of work here, and uh, I need to like tie tie things up and uh, <laughs> make it tidy a bit. And I don't know what we're gonna do with the with the forest over here, but uh, I wanna clear out some space and maybe flatten out a few areas for new. 
new buildings and maybe we can uh, play a little bit with honey with the bees I think this hive it's abandoned but we're gonna find new ones but yeah that will be it for this episode thank you so much for watching I really hope you're enjoying and if you do please consider giving a like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next episode